Hello everybody, this is Money Mom. Welcome back to the channel. It's Free to Frugal Friday. Let's get started. First of all, one of my girlfriend's mothers had some toilet paper. Doesn't care for this brand, so she gave me several rolls, so I wanted to show you that. One of my friends who doesn't love baking ended up getting this, and she said, you know what, Dawn, I didn't realize I don't really need these. I know you love to bake, so she gave me this great big bag of mini m and M. so I'll use it for baking. The same friend who gave me the toilet paper bought a planner. It was a little bit too cumbersome for her, so she donated it to me. It's nice, thick, and sturdy. I'm going to donate mine from the Dollar Tree to someone, but I thought, you know what? This is a really nice, handy planner, and it gives plenty of space to write things in, and I really like it. Also, at the Dollar Tree, they had some makeup that I hadn't seen before. They had concealers. They also had dark circ ones for dark circles. This is called LA Colors. This one that I picked up is for if you have kind of red skin, you can put this on it and it's supposed to take the redness away. I have kind of a ruddy complexion. I'm going to try it and see if it works. Now, on to the most important part. This is the deal of the day. Uh, I go to different stores. One of the stores I went to today was I went to Dollar Tree, then I went to Aldi's. Aldi's has some great deals, but the thing that surprises me that they sold there was Tyson Tastemakers. I absolutely adore these. I have done product demonstrations on these, but they are very costly. They retail anywhere from $12.99 or $11.99 to $13.99, depending whether you get steak or chicken. They told me at the store that they don't sell these very much, that very often, and they I saw a guy ready to throw tons of these out. I, I couldn't believe it. It really bothers me to see food waste. I've told you guys that before. So a lot of these were going to be expiring today. So I asked the guy there, I said, can I please get a discount? Can I buy these? Sum it up, the guy sold these to me. This one was, the chicken was supposed to be $11.99. The other one is uh, $13.99. He sold them all to me for $5 a piece. I only went $1 over grocery budget. This is something that I want to tell all of us. When we are out grocery shopping, really check dates. I know probably many of you do this, but if you see something that your family would use, but it's like within three days of ex expiration date, and a lot of these folks don't get to marking it down, so the stores have to throw it out. Ask for a discount. Say, can I get 75% off? The worst they can do is say no. I mean, a lot of this stuff's perfectly good food. So that's my big tip. I got all this stuff for $5 each. What I'm going to do next week, instead of a no-spend January, which a lot of people are doing and they're rocking their no-spend January, way to go everybody, I'm going to do, instead of my $100 a week grocery budget, I'm going to slash that grocery budget in half and I'm going to do a video about what can $50 buy you and I'm going to do a meal plan with it. So I'm going to show you what does a $50 grocery budget look like and we'll see what happens from there. Before letting you go, I want to do a shout out to a wonderful guy named Valentine who I've had the blessing and honor to get to talk to. He has a channel called Plentoons of Money. I call him Plenty of Money. And the main reason why I wanted you to check him out is he's quite different than my channel. He talks a lot about investing, which is really great. You know, also the other channel, True Financials, which I've linked and told you about Dennis before, he talks quite a bit about investing. It's a subject that I would love to learn more about, and so I'm glad that I have subscribed to both of these wonderful guys. But I really would love if you could go check his uh, channel out. He's very charming and can't say enough good things about him. Tomorrow I'm going to talk to you about is free always worth it? And I've got a couple funny stories to tell you about that one. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I love you so much, and have a great night. Bye-bye.